I try to not to fit the mold of the typical custom bike builder. Feature cam absolutely was a good tool to allow me to do that. Been riding motorcycles and fabricating all my life, and I just like to try things and see if they work. And, and, and but this saves a lot of expense that way. <laughs> Originally, the motorcycles were done the old-fashioned way, uh, manual machining and good old-fashioned belt sanders and grinders and whatnot. You'd always have that thought, man, wouldn't it be cool if we could do this or you know something like that would be really nice. And Blue Ridge Community College offers a free training course on SolidWorks and Feature Cam. We went over and we took the course and realized that it was definitely a good investment to get into. The advantage of the Feature Cam is that now I can come up with a concept in my head I guess and I can take a look at what it's going to look like before I spend a half a day making the part and then not liking it and throw it in the trash can. It also has drastically reduced the amount of time I, I, it takes me to make a part. I can go from a concept to a finished part in, in one afternoon now whereas you know it used to take me several days. The biggest challenge on a, on a motorcycle is keeping it beautiful and yet functional all at the same time. A motorcycle ultimately is to be uh, ridden up uh, interstate highway, so you've always got to have a safety aspect in mind. I like to do things as I go when I'm working on a motorcycle and, you know, I see something that I need and I kind of dream it up in my brain here and now I can sit down and virtually machine it right here, make changes to it. We've gotten a lot of, uh, a lot of publicity, a lot of advertisement, won quite a few awards and uh, it's really unbelievable, you know. Now we can program, set up and run a job that, you know, in a day that you know used to take several days just to just to get the first part off and really feature cam is allowed to create other things that uh, otherwise were just kind of a dream floating in the air i guess you'd say